Well, this morning, deputies continue to investigate what led a woman to steal an ambulance before plowing head on into a semi, killing the driver of the truck and herself. And 23 ABC's Leslie Mudding joins us with what investigators and witnesses are now telling us. Leslie. Mike Aaron, two hall ambulance paramedics are lucky to be alive this morning. It all started as they were responding to a seizure call last night in Frazier Park. But once they arrived, a woman carrying a knife forced her way into the ambulance, turning the situation deadly in just minutes. Left almost unrecognizable, onlookers try to piece together this horrific scene that left two dead last night. Hopefully, the, I, I feel so sorry for the family. I don't know whatever possessed that. Investigators say it started just before 6 p.m., miles away in a Fraser Park neighborhood. That's where paramedics responding to a call were hijacked by a woman carrying a knife. When clearing the scene, an individual with a, a knife approached the uh, paramedic and the EMT. Uh, they immediately did the right thing, removed themselves from harm's way, at which point the individual climbed into the driver's seat of the ambulance and left the scene. The woman then drove the ambulance nearly 35 miles away to the Flying J truck stop off the I-5. That's where witnesses say things turned tragic. And we saw it coming down the road, and the truck was in the middle getting ready to go to turn. So he's straight in line. That ambulance hit that truck driver head on. There was no brakes. There was no swerving, nothing. In the end, the woman died on scene with the truck driver passing just moments later. I have no knowledge other than this could have been prevented. And the name of the truck driver or the woman have not been released. And this morning, the Kern County Sheriff's Office continues to work with CHP to find out what led to this horrific situation. Back to you. All right, Leslie, thank you. 23 ABC sent out several push alerts about this accident last night, instantly giving viewers the latest information on the crash as it happened. Now, if you would like to receive breaking news alert with up-to-the-minute updates right to your smartphone, download our free 23 ABC mobile and tablet app.